Welcome to Game Theory Counter, I'm Connor, and welcome to a game called Dead Play. I've been seeing people talk about this and say how great of a game it is. So, uh, I don't know much about this game, though. Uh, apparently, it's about uh, this. You play the main character and needs a job. It's been the 60s, uh, I think. Or, and the pair needs a job, so they get a job at a restaurant, an Italian restaurant. I think Italian restaurant. I'm not just sure again. And uh, apparently, there's something about cannibals. So, uh, let's go ahead and uh, hop into it. Without further ado, new shift. I'm excited for this game, though. This game looks so cool. It looks similar to Mori. Warning, this game is a work of fiction. There may be contents of graphic death, blood, gore, violence, uh, cannibalism, and ice cream. Okay. Controls. All right. Oh, the character looks so cute. Proceed to continue. Of course. Yeah. Sorry, guys. Show up at 5 p.m. Tutorial. Skip. I uh, sleep in. Unapproved. No, let's show up at 5 a.m. The tutorial. I need this. Tutorial. I don't know. Oh yeah. I'm scared. This adorable. Oh wow! You actually showed up for training. On time too. Barely. There's a highly set off position. Be grateful if you're even. You're even getting the benefit of being told how to do your job. Your resume showed many, many jobs in the service industry. So I assume you already have some of this down. No, I'm choosing to ignore the rate at which you got new positions. Hey, having 28 service industry jobs over the course of seven years is pretty impressive when you think about it. And even less impressive when you think about it for five seconds more than that. But with these jobs, you likely already know about the customer, how to set customers. So go to the counter and get them the appropriate table. Keep in mind how many people are dining. You don't want a large group crowding around a private area. All right. Let me move the air. Oh! Let's give already. So, all right, so we gotta go to the customer, of course. Hello. Table for two, please. Let's seat them. You can't see anymore. Okay, okay, yeah. Uh, sorry, table for two. We have seat right here. Seat them here. Great job. I'll take a moment to see what we're serving today. Once they're ready, they'll put their menu down. And you'll go check on them. Uh, what we're serving today. Yes, uh, patrons don't pick what they eat. Instead, we have a strict menu that changes to daily. You know that if you read the interview. You would know that if you read the interview. Uh, I, um, skimmed it. Hmm. Oh, do you know what you want? Alright, let's go eat. Take their order. I'd like an appetizer. Once you have their meal ticket, bring it to the marker between the window and the door. Then I'll send it to the kitchen. The cooks will start working on whatever you order right away, but keep in mind that Patreon is cooking the dessert, side, meal, and appetizer in that order. Don't pester or distract any of the cooks if they're taking too long. Where's the window? Oh, yeah, go over here. Whoops, yeah, guys, I'm, I'm blind. Waiting. Once your orders are finished, you'll find out the window. Pick it up and order bring the customers. Okay. Okay. I'm getting a little used to the It's not working guys. Good job, they're taking one with me. Yeah, yeah, okay, I already read that. All right, guys, I'm finally back. I finally got back. Sorry about that. Uh, the controls wouldn't work. Um, I still don't know how you give it to them. I can't.
It won't let me eat. Thank you. Oh, okay, I found it. I like an appetizer, okay. All right, guys, finally, okay, we got it. Thank you. Once they're done with the appetizer, they'll ask you once more to go back over. Don't keep them waiting long. Take their order. I'd like main. And you? I like main. Okay, two mains. All right. Okay, let's serve them with their dish. Thank you. All right, let's give them their dish now. Thank you. Once they're ready for the bill, go behind the counter to check them out. All righty. Here's your money. You've earned 200 C. Most customers will ask for the full course of appetizers, sides, meals, and desserts. Once they're done with their meals, make sure to clean their tables. I don't want guests thinking we leave messes out in the open. Alright. Clean up. The trash is full. Are you not able to clean the table? If that's the case, the trash is probably full. Come back to the kitchen to check the garbage. We'll be right to the back door. Yes, we need to come back to the kitchen. This is chefs. Ugh, yeah, it seems like it is. If you can't clean the table, that means there's nowhere for the scraps to go. Check the trash and bring it out of the alley behind the kitchen to throw it out. Trash, alright. This game seems easy so far. Where are you going to this? Huh? Alright guys, I'm back. Alright, now let's go back in. Okay, I don't really need the mouse really. I'm gonna move it to here. Yes, I'll see. Okay. Okay, now do we what do we mm -hmm. Stop, stop, stop. There are no timers on HomePod. Ask. Most customers will ask for the full course of their time. Same meals and dirts. Once they're done with their meal, make sure to clean the table. Okay, yep, yeah, sorry. I forgot. I forgot about cleaning the tables. Yes, yes. Forgot. Forgot. Clean up. Cleaned up. I'll let you take the next customer on your own. Alright, yay. Alright, hold on. Let me. Oh, did I already take it? I think I already took it. I guess I don't have to take it. This trash can. Alright. Well, let's go ahead and take their order. Hello. Table for one, please. Okay, let's seat them. Alright. We'll put you right here. Seat them here. All right. Oh, okay. What do you want, sir? Take their order. I'd like an appetizer. All right. Let me just take it to the kitchen. All right. This is fun so far. I do like this so far. This is a nice, cute little game. I love the characters' designs. They're adorable. And I, I just like being a little waitress. Yeah, appetizer. All right. Here you go, sir. Thank you. Okay, I'll be waiting behind the counter for you to finish your order. This game is really fun though. I really do like it. I'm not, I, I don't know the characters' names really. I keep forgetting. They probably said label. I'll have to look next time. Yes, do you have uh, any boxes that you can hit a chance? Uh, yes, we do. Ah, I apologize. He's new, but we don't have to, and we don't have to go boxes, no. We don't have to go boxes, no. Oh, thank you for the correction, Chef. 
I won't be around to correct you when you're open, so make sure you actually know what you're talking about next time. Right, yes, chef, but, uh, but what should we do if I don't know the an what the answer is? Every time you, you cannot, uh, let, uh, let, to let, everything you cannot, uh, you cannot to let the patron know that. There are conveniences of the money, if you have to guess, that's fine. Just as long as you make it look like you know what you're doing and don't promise anything we do for them. I'd like a main. All right. What? Okay. All right, there we go. Thank you for everyone leaving. What? Uh, did that one leave? They're probably expecting for fast level speed anyways. We want them coming here. The good news is they probably saw the paper meals they don't eat. But in the off chance, a respectable customer loses their patience and leaves. They will likely won't leave and tips are paying for the further meals. It's in your best interest not to let that happen. But that did leave you with the dead plate. Unless another table wants that exact order. You're stuck with it until you throw it away. A perfect gum meal gone to waste. We're going back to the trash can. Alright. Sad. Good way. Good way. Good work. Some other things may come up for now, but you seem prepared enough. We'll be opening in just a moment. Are you all set? Start shift. I think we're good. I think we can do this, guys. Here we go. Yay. Now that you're properly trained and you're ready to actually start working, here's our menu for the day. Okay, appetizer, main, side, and dessert. All right, if you need me, I'll be back in the back. Good luck. All right, let's give this a try. Oh, wait, can I? Hello. So this looks like the exact same person that came for the Toro. Tip for two, please. Okay, let me seat you over here. See them here. This is the same people that came to the store. Oh, it's fine, it's fine. Alright. Take their order. I'd like an appetizer. Okay. Take their order. I'd like an appetizer. Okay, let me. Okay, you only you need seats or the same. Give them for one, please. Okay. Oh, do I need to... Hold on. Thank you. Alright. Okay, and... There you go. Give the order. I can appetize it. Okay. Give the order. I can main. Okay. Come on. Okay, hold up. Thank you. Oh, wait. Oh, it's the end of the day. Shift and shift. Day one, shift complete. You've earned green onion rolls. Ooh, that was fun. I liked that. Uh, now we're at the house. Cool. Let the cat look at the window. Let's look out the window. That's pretty. Nothing out of the ordinary. Worn out guitar in the ground. Escapes a piece of love letters and lyrics are for you. I should finish up writing these. A messy wardrobe, of course. Look in the fridge, of course. Okay, nothing much, nothing much. We do have the rolls, though. The freezer is empty. Hmm. Interesting. Call her. Let's not do it yet. Read the catalog or not. Let's read through it. Magazine for gourmet living. Cologne increases customer patience. When off the town, overizing your suite, only one cologne will do. Our sweet love and scent of fragrance is the highest quality scent on the market. It will grant its weird and inherited refinement. Skates increases player speed. Watch increases time and shift. 
I like, uh, Black Cat Strike matches off Rallaby with consistent and strong flames. A compact and discreet package to provide variety of luxurious essentials. Mm hmm. Yes, I get it. What? What is this? Oh, uh, at the game. Uh, when Chef uh, uh, Chamberoni, I am putting this in a new restaurant. Yep. It's grown steady, successful, among older, more classified Renee Pantrons. Uh, however, after six years of its opening, it's remained a modern dining location. Despite many initial concerns of its monthly rotation and strict menu, growing sta stale as a form of uh, accomptimary dining. Despite the dining experience that's staying consistent, and critics have recently noted a, dra a drastic shift in employee numbers. I asked him about these changes. I pride my location not only on where I can personally bring to the table, but on the talent and need my work can do to provide. I asked what is no one of the process of maintaining his bistro's well-known standard was like with the noticeably low of employee numbers. Not only do the customers deserve good service, but my staff can deserve a job where they can be utilized and their effort won't be able to waste. My hiring process reflects that. Trash can, tip jar. That's it. Interesting. Okay. What's in the TV? An old TV, most expensive thing in the apartment. Some parts of the screen are cracked, but you can still make out the images. Oh, I got it at later. Someday, eventually. It's all burn over. It's the last time I've ever made my favorite cereal. We're heat leftovers. Oh, right, not right now. Hold on. And horse. Well, it's a bike, but you treat it like a horse every time you go with the work with it. Get out of the couch. Let's save real quick. File one. Okay. You know, let's reheat some leftovers. You end up burning them. I should just stick to takeout or something. Okay. Let's call her. What's she answer? Who is her? Who is she? There you go. Day two, equipped. Ooh. You don't have any of this stuff. Right, stop it there. I think we're ended there. So thanks y'all for watching. If you like this video, subscribe. And that was part one of Dead Plate. So uh, make sure you like the video for the next part. And uh, we'll end it there. Bye.